Hi there, my name is Anna and I am currently based in Bali, Indonesia. I felt very drawn to this particular necklace from Ananda's soul that is the I Dare to Shine angel necklace. Um, mostly because of its engraving on the backside of the pendant that says, I dare to shine brightly. I did a yoga teacher training last year in March, shortly before the pandemic hit the world. And um, during the yoga teacher training, usually you're being asked to pick your sankalpa, your main intention, um, why you want to be a yoga teacher or what your idea what your message is that you want to bring out into the world and um, at that time what came through for me was the, were the words I dare to shine. I dare to shine aiming at myself but also um, at being a reminder for others to grant themselves the permission to be more of themselves, to tap into that inherent inner light that we all carry inside of us. Ultimately, we all have it in us, that little light or that big radiant light. Um, so this is a little more personal. Um, in a previous life, as I like to say, um, I was very much someone who had very little self-confidence and was playing small, bending, not really allowing myself to have an opinion often, or to voice my own opinion, often in favor of others, to not hurt anybody's feelings. Um, I barely allowed myself to have boundaries too, which is what ultimately led to having my boundaries overstepped. Um, that changed, and while I've been on my own personal journey back towards me, as I like to say, for a few years now, um, this particular Sankalpa is still valid and is still around. And having this necklace is that I also love to wear almost every day is that particular beautiful reminder for me to dare to be who I am. Um, because it's, it is such a great pleasure and it's such beautiful inspiration when people come together in all of their radiance in all of their greatness in all of when they show up with all that they have and all that they are so ultimately i myself have to be like that as well right thank you